kicking things off this morning. Very mild morning start. You're not going to be reaching for that sweater or jacket as you head out the door. The wind is calm now, but don't let these calm conditions fool you. The strong breezes will be returning throughout the afternoon and evening. So we start things out with temperature 67 Henderson, 68 degrees in Ellis Air Force Base with 63 in North Vegas and Pahrump as temperatures warm very quickly. So if you're looking for the best opportunity to head out for that walk or jog to get the pets out, I would do so nice and early, well before the lunch hour, because once we start to see temperatures reaching into the 80s, the pavement starts to heat up, and we don't want it to be too warm for their paws. So again, before the lunch hour, I would say, you know, as soon as the sun rises or right thereafter, will be the perfect opportunity to be very comfortable with temps into the low 70s. We make our way well into the mid to upper 80s with a forecast high today of 90 degrees. We're bringing on the sunshine. We're bringing on the wind, gusting into the 30 to 40 mile per hour range. Red flag warning will be going into effect. I'll let you know how long these conditions will be persisting for us because we're even tracking some big changes that will be taking place as early as tomorrow. Full look at the seven day forecast it will be just 15 minutes away. But for now, let's switch gears over to traffic as we have our first accident of the morning reported. This is our camera at I-15 in Desert Inn. You can see all of these flashing lights and cars having to very slowly get by this crash so just be prepared to encounter this if your travels take you down the i-15 especially near the desert inn area because it looks like it's taking place right on that on-ramp where you go from desert inn to jump onto the i-15 so just be prepared to encounter that because of course we want you to stay safe even seeing the flashing lights from our spring mountain camera want to let you know which direction that this accident is occurring in so let me check some of our websites right now i believe it is i-15 northbound where this accident is currently occurring. So again, just be safe out there as you make your way out the door this morning. We go from those traffic cameras to our traffic maps. Again, seeing some slowing. Looks like it is actually occurring on the southbound side, not the northbound side. So again, I-15 southbound right near Spring Mountain. You will be encountering those flashing lights and just a few delays. No other accidents reported. If that changes, of course, we'll keep you posted. That's a look at weather and traffic for now. And Kirika and Dave, I'll send it back over to you. Thanks so much, Cass. Now, starting to